Oh, you know what that sound means. Summer's in its final weeks. If you're looking for something unique to do this Labor Day, boy, do we have you covered. We've put together a list of 100 hidden gems for you to check out. I love these. For this one, we take you to a live look right now to Edgewater Beach. A lot of us have been there already, but a lot of people are cooking out right now, enjoying some of the great weather. Tonight, though, photojournalist Dave Colobine shares the magic of one of Edgewater's most Instagrammable treasures. We're here in Edgewater Park next to the beach in front of this iconic willow tree that has captured the imagination of Clevelanders for many, many years now. I used to come here um, in high school, so, and that's where we used to hang out underneath on the rocks over there. So it's kind of fun to come back and walk around and see it. It reminds me of the good old days. This is the first time we've been down here in a long time. Set apart from all the other trees, so it's kind of cool. It's like your eye is immediately drawn to it. We actually noticed it from the pier up the coast. It was really nice and peaceful and shade. It was a good place we were both talking about. We'd, we'd love to take a nap. We get questions all the time about this tree. It just looks like it's old. Why it's here, who planted it. Like it's been there forever. Where it came from. So this tree has probably seen a lot of history here. We don't know the real answer to a lot of those questions. We do know, how however, that the land I'm standing on, the land that tree is standing on, was not here prior to 1950. This is all landfill. We don't know if the city planted the tree at that time or if a passing bird dropped the seed that became the tree. This one shows up on maps at least around 1979. You can see from the aerial views that the tree was here then. It's actually in a perfect spot at the edge right before the lake. Willow trees love the water. They love to have their roots in the water. Obviously where this tree is sitting, that's a great spot for water. Willow trees grow fairly easily. They grow fast and they grow big. It's getting near the upper end of its life cycle. Willow trees grow uh, to be about 50 or 60 years old. And we have weddings here, we have graduation pictures here. Uh, we're here to get some family pictures done for mom's birthday. We just wanted something that was like classic Cleveland. You can see it from the shoreway. People just love to come here. I think there's something about a willow tree. It's like, you know, it's flowing in the air. A willow tree inspires the imagination. It's very poetic. And it's gorgeous, it's like music. It's beautiful, it's relaxing. It's a great place to come and just unwind. It's actually... Makes me feel... Soothing, I would say. Peaceful for sure and grounded. You can tell it has a lot of wisdom. If you're here, luckily, alone, you can sit under that tree, watch the waves, and it's just, it's just a beautiful spot. Shavasana on your backs. Let's start on your backs just to enjoy the sky for a moment. I love Edgewater and I love to teach classes here when I can. Breath in and out of the nose. We love the tree, which is why we park by the willow tree. Take a couple more big, full breaths here, guys. Every time I come, I'm always amazed. I'm always relaxed. It's, it's a beautiful scene. All the way up, drinking that view. There's been something really beautiful about hearing like people get back to life. It's the best spot in Cleveland. <laughs> Hmm. I'm relaxed just watching it. Yeah, that was right? a good one. That was awesome. Yeah, I mean, some incredible storms, that thing. Storms, yeah. that thing. Our, our uh, digital team did extensive research on the tree and the development of the park itself. And you can read all about it right now on our News 5 app. And while you're there, you can check out all the other hidden gems that we have up there. Some of which you may never have even heard about. Yeah, you know what? I told Joe Donatelli and his team, that's one of the greatest things that, that, that we've done cool. in years. Holy yeah. cow. That, if, you, if you have a few awesome. minutes, check that thing out because it's, it's really wonderful. And when they put the call out to the newsroom to find some, everybody's got three. Everybody's got their three favorite places to go yep. that other people may not know about. Off the beaten track. I said, well, that, that's cool. just great. Yeah. So well done. All right. Hi, Mark. How are you? Good. Another hidden gem. <laughs> <laughs>